Hello everyone, today is a great day because Two Point Campus is finally here. It has released on all the major platforms. I'm playing it on Game Pass right now for PC, so go check it out if you got Game Pass, it's on there. Uh, we're gonna jump right in. I love Two Point Hospital and I can't wait to see what this game has got in store for us. That looks so cool. I, I'm gonna do a terrible job. That's what's gonna happen here. I'm gonna do an awful job as a as an administrator of a campus. Uh, I'm Albert Crank, your own personal advisor, and I'm here to help. You may not have any experience as a campus administrator, but the people of Freshly County College are eager to give you a chance. I'm not sure what that says about them, but hey, let's head to Freshly Meadows and get started on your academic adventure. Empire, Empire. I'm already tripping up on words. I'm so excited. Um, okay, so this countryside college has low expectations and a nice canal. <laughs> That's important. It's the perfect place to start your career. Okay, so starting funds, $500,000. Let's go. A university is not something that one simply opens, like a savings account or a jar of pickles. Any self-respecting academic institution was doubtlessly opened long ago by dignified people who wore bowler hats and spoke via subtitle, The world is a creation of the past, and it is our job to keep it all going and try not to touch anything. We are definitely opening this thing like a jar of pickles. That is happening. All right, now what? It's got to be some kind of a tutorial, right? Welcome to Freshly Meadows, where life moves slowly and expectations are lowly. I like that slogan. That's great. The Two Point Countryside is the perfect place to start your career, learn the ropes, make mistakes, and hit the ground smiling. So we're gonna. It looks like we're gonna do some Scientography. Student intake ten. Okay. Welcome to campus. Before you start churning out geniuses, you'll need to learn the basics of campus management. Try right, moving the camera and having a look around. Okay. We did that. Zoom, zoom. And the camera, we're good. I guess we know how to run a college now. Our campus is going to be running a Scientography course, so let's start by building a science lab. Okay. Put X to do that, we'll go into the build thing. Science lab, it costs $18,200 to open. And it's a five by five. Okay, fair enough. Um, I think we're gonna go over here. This looks this looks like a really good spot to, to put one of these. So let's uh, let's try this out. It's five. Oh, we went too far. They're five by five. Okay. Can't put a door there, of course. Um, how about there? And this is a okay. That's our our chalkboard or whatever. So we're gonna put this over here. Visitors should be checked in. This looks like it should go kind of like this. So there's lots of space. Yeah, that looks good. Now what do we got? Are we done? Oh, what is this? What what is, what am I working on here? Are we done? I think we're done. Or do I have to move this? Maybe I had to move it. Okay. Oh yeah, we are done. There we go. We did. We built the science lab. That's all we needed. Now let's hire a teacher to run our Scientography course. Okay. We have to go over here to teachers. 
This teacher specializes in Scientography, it looks like. Required to teach Scientography. 70% teaching skill. Lillian Lentils. Squeaky clean, excellent personal hygiene. Run-of-the-mill teacher. 4.2 thousand, almost. I mean, that's like a quarter of what it costs to... Oh, look at us, we're just dragging them. Looks like you're riding a bicycle. Okay. In the room you go? Teacher cannot work in science? Wait a second. Why did it say they can't work there? Great work. Now we have everything we need to run our Scientography course. When you're ready, select start next year to welcome our first year students. Well, we're going to go for it. Now they're out there. What are they doing? Are they having a dart out there? We're going to start the year. Here we go. Now what are we doing? Are the students coming? Hi. Uh, the students are arriving on campus. Are you nervous? You Why am I nervous? Oh, I'm campus radio. pretty nervous. Unfortunately, our broadcast All right, here they come. So up to 10 students. Due to some of our equipment being prematurely recycled. One of our reporters is I count one, two, three, four, five, six students. Do you all have individual so, names? Like if I click on you. Visual and we'll be right back. Oh, you do? Oh, I can actually expel a student. This is Kensington Cods Codswallop? Are you ready? Uh, are you sure you want to expel Kensington? At least my family are understanding is what I would say if it were true. Haha, <laughs> you've got to laugh. Please laugh. No, we're not going to expel them. That was just a test. Welcome to the start of a new year. Whoa, 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 where are you guys going? What? Okay, so we've got the Scientography room. This is where we're going to teach lessons, it looks like. Lecture seating? Okay. Where's my teacher? Oh, boy. Here comes the rest. Here comes the other four. And there was a little worm in the yard. These guys are just sitting on benches. Look at that. Students are in their very first class. Who knows what will happen? Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Oh, I remember days like that. I was a big nerd. I was always in science. So class complete. So we can speed this up. Right? That's what we're going to do. I We didn't have anything like that when I was in college. Uh, as students learn, they gain ex experience points, or XP, which will increase their academic level. Fair enough. Monthly profits? We're making money? Hand over fist? Look at that. $9,000, easy. The teacher's paying less attention than the students? This is, this is bad. And why are these guys outside? Okay, is there something... What, what are they doing? Oh boy, he just blew something up. I'm, I'm curious why my teacher's doing this. So class is over. Slow things down. They did it. The students passed their first class. Sadly, they didn't do all that well. It seems a number of them were distracted by one or the other. <laughs> well, that happens, right? There's a fly in here. Uh, a student that has everything they need will be more happy, less distracted, and be able to focus on their studies in an enthusiastic and cheerful haze. Well, what was this? Hey, 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 who threw garbage on the ground? As a student's needs, such as their thirst or toilet comfort, will affect their overall happiness. Happy students perform better in classes and earn more XP. Makes sense? Take a look at our students and see what we can do to improve campus. Okay, so let's, let's have a little pause here. The key to campus hospitality is to remember the three R's. Students need somewhere to relax themselves. Well, they've got that. They've got that. They've got the benches, right? And picnic tables. To rest themselves. Well, they could sleep on those and relieve themselves. Uh, I don't think we would want them relieving themselves on the benches and picnic tables. That's an issue. Sure, two of those might be the same thing, but it does sound convincing. Let's build a dormitory and a bathroom. Keep people comfortable. Fair enough. Okay, so let's zoom out a little bit here. We've got to build a bathroom because people are starting to get mad, right? We're going to go in here, take this out. Dormitory. Where the magic sleeping happens. Students sleep to regain their energy. Keep students happy by decorating their dormitory and providing at least one bed for every five students. 
Okay, that sounds like real college. Receive monthly rent based on accommodation rating. Students are automatically assigned accommodation. So room size is two by two. So we need at least two of two beds, right? Because we've got 10 students. Only half of them showed up for class, but that's that doesn't matter. So do we only build inside of here right now? I guess we do, right? We don't own this property. Cannot build this plot. You don't own it. Well, fair enough. Okay. I don't own any of this. It must be placed in a building. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. We're going to put the dormitory over here, separate from the classrooms. That sounds good. And it's a two by two. That's it? That's all they get? Really? And a door. That's all you get. How do we toggle through there? Well, we have a dresser. Okay, good. We have a dresser. We'll put like, um, oh man, this looks like a prison cell. This does not look like, this looks like two point prison. Okay, so that's one. One dormitory done. Now, they did say build a bathroom as well. We definitely don't have enough dormitories. So old, out with the old, in with the new. Relieves toilet need, improves hygiene. Minimum room size, two by one. I mean, that's the minimum room size, right? I suppose I should have made that dormitory bigger. I'm going to flop really badly at this. So hopefully you guys enjoy watching me be terrible. Um, let's put the bathroom kind of like over here. This seems good. So a minimum bathroom size of two by one. Let's go double that, right? Let's just get that out of the way. Go four by two. That seems like a massive colossal waste of space. Maybe we'll put a garbage can there. Okay, now we have a toilet stall. I could put a second toilet stall. I think that's a good idea. Now we have a bathroom and it even came with its very own window, which the, oh, it's because I put it there. Maybe I should have put the dorm there. <laughs> Did you hear that? I think students might be hungry. Traditionally, campuses offer a range of food and drink. You know, sustained life. Let's add some vending machines. Okay, we can do this. We got this. Vending machines. Uh, what do we want? Do we want a hand sanitizer? You can't eat that. Well, you shouldn't eat that. I shouldn't say you can't. Um, the country's favorite snack. Cheesy Gubbins machine. And we'll get a burp machine as well. Okay. We'll put those outside the bathroom, maybe? Or on the entrance to the building, perhaps? It'd be good. Or maybe like outside the lecture room. Like when you first walk into the building, the first thing you want to grab is a snack, right? Uh, snacky foods always go on the left and the other always goes on the right. Now I haven't figured this out. How do I, how do I toggle? Oh, there we go. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Um, there we go. Beautiful. So we've accomplished that task as well. If it were up to the students, I'm sure we'd all be living in our own filth. Luckily, they have very little to say in the matter. Let's hire a janitor and place a bin to keep things nice and tidy. Yes, we need a janitor. Okay, so back out of that. Now, let's find ourselves a janitor. You are not a janitor. This is teachers. This is janitors. Okay, so now we have a pick. We have Wendy Stop. We have Pookie Beeves or Grainy Mouth. Boost maintenance speed, maintenance skill. Movement speed up. Okay, so they come with little boosts. I think we go with, I'm kind of feeling uh, Grain Mouth. Pookie Beeves sounds more like a janitor. Apologies to anybody that is Pookie that's named Pookie that's watching this. So Pookie Beeves, uh, recruitment fee 2300, maintenance plus 30% maintenance skill, weak bladder, toilet comfort decreases faster than most, squeaky clean, excellent personal hygiene, rapid, moves faster than most, can't picture it. Huh. Okay, well we're hiring you. Just, uh, you know what, we're going to start you in the bathroom. There you go, bud. Pookie. And we're going to place a bin. Is that here? Perhaps there's a bin. 
a rubbish bin. Put one in the bathroom. We're gonna put a couple of these out here. Put a rubbish bin next to uh next to the vending machines also. Can I put it between them? That'd be that'd be wonderful. I'll put a rubbish bin there. Sure. Let's see how the students do in their next class. Okay. We're gonna fire it back up. Oh boy. Unpause. And so is our broadcasting signal. Hey, what's this? Who's Thanks littering on the ground? The Hopefully skip. Pookie takes care By of all this. On account, he was happy to do it, adding that the view from inside the skip offered him an entirely new perspective. Pass a scientography campus. class with a now, C plus. Oh, look at them go! Segment, yeah. I don't know what is. Pookie's cleaning a room that nobody's it used. How desperate you are. Oh, no he's growing the plants. Nobody urinate on on the campus facilities. If I click on you, happiness is not good. Okay, absolutely bursting, tired. So now they're going to go and wait in line for bed. Oh man, this is bad. We should have definitely made this bigger. The room is full of people. There's a lineup in the dormitory. This is bad. This is not what you want. What is this? Is that is that a, a some kind of costume? You went to bed before going to the bathroom? Oh man, this is this is bad. We're gonna need more dormitory. This is looking terrible. <laughs> we're gonna need we're gonna need another room. Let's put it right here beside it. Another two by two cell. And uh, we'll put a. Uh, Home is where the heart is. Required to complete room. Um, let's put the let's put this one in here. Right there, beautiful. And we also need another dresser, or whatever you want to call this, a cabinet. There we go. We completed that room. Cancel room now. That's what we want. We have built another dormitory. Now, hopefully, this solves some of our issues. Right. Oops. Is the teacher even in the classroom? They are not. Single single rooms only. I have no idea what these people are doing in these closets. What are you guys doing in these closets? What's going on in here? Okay, they're getting happier though. This is good. You better go to the bathroom. We don't have a sink in the bathroom for hand washing, and I feel like that's not a good... Like, that's not the way it should be. Can we get a sink for our washroom? Maybe it's in the building, actually. Rooms? There's a shower? No, that's, that's actual rooms, right? I'm looking for something different. Do I have to make them start their class? Like, what's going on here? We're learning. Not very fast. Okay, so... I really, really, really want... more in this bathroom. Is this all that's available to us, though? Corridor items? Favorites? Recommended? How do I get over there? All of the items, favorites. Okay, there we go. Recommended. Structural, food and drink, seating, decorative. So there's there's no there's no taps or anything. Okay, well, you know what? I'm fine with it. There's no taps or anything for washing your hands. There's hand sanitizer. Perhaps I should put that in the washroom. You know, just a little... Yourself a little squirt on the way out, maybe? Right? I feel like that's smart. Let's hear from Hugh, who's fresh out the skip with a story about an unusually cloudy next weekend for one of the county's hottest locations. Oh, it's... Oh, they're teaching a class in here? A lecture? Okay, everybody get to class. Why are you wearing a clown Students nose? Students at the Breaking Point campus were expecting a weekend full of sun, laughter, and well, they're learning. fun. Boost this up a but bit. A dark cloud 
has washed away their optimism, At? leaving them with sadness. And These guys no are getting better. They're getting smarter. That sun cream. They Happiness. The weekend of sun and balmy temperatures. Still only a Scientography level of C. Altogether great they are happy. Affair. Spare a thought for them, sitting inside. That's going to take some sandals, practice to get used to, for sandals. sure. Their skin. That's a bit cool, creepy. The janitor sweeping burnt. the room while they're sleeping in it. Fliss, a little bit creepy. You. Scientography lecture starting now. Just now, it's almost over. Let's see what happens here. It's been a bit of a mad scramble. Okay, class is out. Well done. Those students look smarter already. They better... Wait. The better they do, the more money you'll have to fund the campus. Who's smart now? Oh, wow. We did actually make more money. Yes, you receive tuition fees from all students enrolled in courses at the campus, as well as a bonus for how much XP they're earning. Okay. Satisfying student needs is just one way to improve our grades. Next on the agenda is a spot of studying. A spot of studying. Luckily, the students have just been given their first assignments. Okay. Completing assignments is a great way for students to earn XP away from the classroom. Though it looks like they need Education some new facilities. Check your inbox possible. to see what they need. I'll give it a little pause. Check the inbox. Welcome to your inbox, a place to check on student requests, disaster warnings, and upcoming visits. Oh, like, uh, like health visits and stuff? Some campus issues are time sensitive, so keep an eye out for new messages. Fair enough. We need a library. Dave Rainbow. It wants to do a library orientation. Look at these books. Okay, so we're going to build a room. We have to do it, right? We've got to do it. We've got nine people in agreement that I have to do this thing. Whether I like it or not. Three by three library? So we're not going to put that there. We're going to put the library. This is kind of an inconvenient place. Kind of an inconvenient spot for a library, isn't it? But let's, let's do it. We're only going to do three by three. Actually, maybe it's not that bad. Now we have a bookshelf. And a computer. Wonderful. Another bookshelf. Let's, um... Hmm, how do I want to do this? Put that like that. And we have this little desk here that we'll put... Put that there like that. Yes. Okay, library complete. We have to hire a librarian now. Janitor needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. Unblock toilets? Oh, man. We don't have enough garbage bins? I think that's a problem. Complete an assignment in the library. Hire an assistant. Oh, boy. Teachers, assistants. Let's have a look at this, okay? We have an Isaac Spatula, boost learning or library learning rate. That could be good. Do they all do that? Boost movement speed. Makes themselves smile. <laughs> Who's that? Robert Chump? Honey Carnage? Oh, I like that. But I like Isaac Spatula with the with the library learning. So we're gonna hire Isaac. He's expensive, but only the best for our students. Recruitment fee is twenty four hundred. So he's got library management, uh, plus 5% learning boost, aerodynamics, more movement speed, bottomless pit, gets hungry easily, naturally curly. I like it. Hired. Throw him in here. There we go. We hired that. Now complete an assignment in the library. Is anybody actually going to go do that? Do you have to actually tell people to do that? Right? That's what I'm wondering. Do we tell this guy, like, hey, you know, you should go to the library? Mood, entertainment. Scientography, library orientation. Look at these books. Do they just do it? That's what I'm curious about. Maybe they just do it. Oh boy, there's a whole bunch of stuff up here too. You can pin objectives. 
This is gonna take a little bit of learning, for sure. Let's unpause it and see if anybody does anything. Bungle, the small car that makes the little things feel Ooh, What are you doing? It's a perspective thing. Some students are completing an assignment in the library. They're a level four? Completing the assignment is a great way to earn XP. Oh, they all went there. We got the best students. We really do. So smart. We should put a bin in this room. I feel like we should have bins in every room. It just feels like the right thing to do. Because, yeah, if you don't, here's what happens. Right? So bins in every room. We have a, we have a bin in there. Bins in every room. Done. It's got to happen. It's only 60 bucks for a little bit of uh, garbage cleanup. There. I don't like the idea of having garbage all over the floor. Pass Scientography class with a B? Oh, maybe I shouldn't put the bathroom halfway across the school, right? This reminds me of one of my jobs that I had. I worked on one side of the factory and the bathroom was on the exact opposite side. And it would take you a solid 10 minutes just to get to the bathroom. And your boss would always be yelling at you, wondering why you weren't like at where you were supposed to be. But it was as simple as I had to go to the bathroom. But they counted that entire 10 minute walk as my as like a break. We can do exterior work. We're just kind of waiting on this class to end so we can hopefully get someone with a B. Unfortunately, nobody, including the teachers, picking up this garbage. Oh, wow. Oh! Oh, don't get hurt. This guy's hard at work. I'm hoping with the increase in garbage bins, we don't have paper lying all over the place. Okay, looks like class is over. Did anybody get a B? This guy totally did. I want to see what's up with this guy. Your students have gone from C grade chumps to B grade brain heads. Let's re recap how you did, shall we? Oh, here we go. Campus Management 101. Provide better staff and facilities to improve your students' grades. Fair enough. Makes Go figure. The, the, the better the teacher, the, the better your kids do in class. Huh. Make students happy and comfortable to increase their learning rate. Earn more cash by growing your campus and enrolling more students. Okay, I understand. Congratulations, you've earned some kudosh for completing objectives. Then kudosh to unlock new items as well as staff outfits and interior design options. Okay. Unlock an item with kudosh. That's our next goal. But I really want to see what this guy's up to. So he did get a B. And he's doing fantastic. Feeling freshly. The giggles. Okay, so we are going to do that. We're going to we're gonna spend some kudosh. We're going to buy a new item. Oh, I see. This is our this is our thing. So down here, we can build a meat, meat wizard machine. We can buy that. From the Bay of Gravy to the Giblet Caves. I think we do that. It's only 15 kudosh. We go crazy here. We could buy this. Test your strength. Just measures weight. Oh man, there's some really cool. Th there's some. There's a lot of items actually that we could be buying right now. But we're gonna build my my dream school, which would start with this: the meat wizard machine. Yes, unlock it. New room unlock. Student lounge. Okay. Um, well, we're not going to buy it right yet, right? We're going to build a lounge, though. Let's do that. Student lounge. We haven't built a shower. We probably do that. Kind of in the vicinity of the bathroom, maybe? Student lounge. Okay, so if we zoom out of this, we have a look at our at our landscape here. The lounge should be relatively close to the... Oh, there's a door there. That's in that's an inconvenient door, isn't it? The lounge can be near the bathrooms, kind of like the chill spot. Whoops. One, two, three. One, two, three. 
Yeah, that looks good. Put a little thing here. And then there's just like you throw a couch in it. Throw a couch. Right, right there. Are we putting a TV in this room? That's the question. I don't know what all we're putting in here, but we're throwing that there. The lounge is built. I was going to put a... Oh, okay. So the item I had, I can't, I don't think I can put it in the lounge. We can buy a foosball table for our students. I loved foosball when I was growing up. Let's, uh, let's rotate this thing. There we go. Actually, it was better the other way, wasn't it? Yeah, like that. There they go. Now they got themselves a little foosball table. I'm all about the student lounge. Oh man, I wish I had one of these when I was a kid. Dartboard above the couch. <laughs> Probably not the safest of ideas. Oh no, we're not canceling anything. We're 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 cruising here. Okay, let's get something else unlocked. Uh huh. I knew it. You guys are all about the student lounge. Used by janitorial staff and the local coast guard. It's a sobering reminder to all of us that you can't There are lots of jobs for janitors around campus. Consider hiring more janitors. Okay. I guess the more people we get, the more janitors we're going to need. We need Amelia Pilfer. If that was spelt with an A at the start, I would do that. That's my wife's first name. I would do. I would hire that. Niam Rubbish. Oh, we have to do that. Boost maintenance speed. I like that. The maintenance speed is a beautiful thing. Who's faster than most? Toilet comfort decreases slower than most. I like it. I are you. Oh, they're all playing darts. Look at that. That's so cool. Okay, there you go. You're in. We need no more staff. Build a staff room. I don't really need another teacher. Maybe we just get the janitors on the go here. We have an assistant. We, we're going to have more janitors than anything. You know what? All the maintenance speed in the world. There we go. We have the staff. staff are reminded to care we have a staff students. room. Staff room next to the library. Very tiny room. They just get a couch. That's all they get. <laughs> That's all they get. They just get a couch. You guys don't need to be super. Why do they get to put a a meat wizard machine in there? Fine. They can have a meat wizard machine. Beautiful. Why am I doing this? There we go. All right, so we've got that room. This guy is really something else. Where's our total of people? Is there like a way for me to check that? I wonder. Because we're, we're getting things done. Finish your first year on campus. Average staff happiness is only 58%. What do I got to do to make them happier? What do you think we need? More uh, more faculty and facilities? We'll put like... Um, we'll put a drink machine in there. Their very own drink machine. Sounds, sounds lovely. And maybe a garbage can. They'll love it. They're going to love this garbage can. It's great. Okay, they're still getting sadder by the minute. I wonder what we can do to increase our staff happiness. I feel like I've done good. I personally feel like I've done everything I can do to make the staff happy.
What do we need to do? Hire more teachers? Another teacher, maybe? Another Scientography teacher? Maybe that would make them happy? Or is that going to make them worse? We're going to find out real quick. That actually made them happier, for sure. Now they just walked out like they're really sad. Uh, extra credit. So average assessment score is 77%. Science, level three science lab. But we have to put more stuff in there. I don't want to actually build another lab, but is there items that we can put in the lab, you know? Corridor items. Structural, food, drink. This is all just corridor. How do I make a better science lab? I have no idea. Complete two assignments? We can do that. We have multiple teachers now. Oh, look, you're taking a break. That's great. They haven't taken a break this entire time. These guys are skipping class. I feel like there's nothing that I can do to make the science lab better. Monthly profits? Did we lose money? We barely made any. We have a little bit of mail. Uh, relationship item request. What? Henrietta Belcher and Felix Colossus. Best friends. Oh no, I've been slowly but surely developing romantic feelings for my friend. Life, eh? Oh boy, we're about to, we're about to get some drama. Tree bench. Unlock and place a tree bench. Okay. We can do that. I'm 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 a bit of a yes man. We're gonna do this. Oh, look at this thing. This is actually really this is actually really romantic. There are lots of jobs for janitors around campus, considering hiring some janitors. I've got three. If they're not doing their jobs, they're fired. If they are not doing what they're hired to do, they're they're done. Statement. Monthly income report. Staff wages. Made up more than what we made. Okay, that's not good. That's not good. These guys are celebrating something. We're going to call it a video here, guys. This was the first look at this game. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more of this, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Comment so that everybody can see this amazing game. I think it's really, really cool. I'm going to play more and more of this probably anyway. Thank you so much. I'll catch you on the next one. Have a fantastic day.